Hi guys, this is another flower near your friendly neighborhood grammarian. Today, right at here, discussing the distinction that is existent between homograph, homonym, and homophone. To start with, I write homo. What do you understand by this word homo when it comes to homo sapien? Sapien, homogeneous, homo means meaning the same. Homo means simply, homo means the same. And then I will write G N P G for graph, N for name, and P for phone. And homo, homo, homo means same. And hoya, homo graph, homo name. And when it comes to here, it is homophone. And to make this easy and worthwhile remembering, to facilitate that process, I have taken four criterion and let me put it like this for you s m o p that is smop smop s for spelling m for meaning o for origin p for pronunciation so this is smop the the four, four criteria are smop so we are going to do the SMOP analysis with the homo graph homonym and homophone to establish the differences that is existence existent between these three. So right to begin with homograph. When it comes to homograph, homo mean the word homo means the same that you learned earlier. And what does graph means? What does graph means? For instance, what does graph means? Graph means have you heard? heard about orthograph or orthography o orthography means spelling S graph means spelling and when it comes to homonym name means name and when it comes to homophone phone means sound or phoneme phone means sound so I'll take my red pen and put two ticks here and put two ticks here so two ticks to the leftmost corner and two ticks to the rightmost bottom corner and and where there are no ticks there will be crosses here 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 here, here and here so let's begin with homograph so homograph is a word that is spelled the same but with differences in meaning origin and pronunciation so I'm repeating homograph is a word that is spelled the same with differences in meaning origin and pronunciation so I will put down the heading homograph homograph and I will list down some examples wind and wind what is this wind w i n d wind this is the current of air that blows across you your body and you can feel and this is wind wind means to turn whose past tense and past participle are wound you can wind a clock you see like that so I'll give you two more examples and then I'll explain it to you this is raw and this is raw this is you, you might have already stood in a raw and this is raw is that there, there is a large huge noise coming from a machine or some social noise so this is present this is that is something given as a gift so you can write it as a gift and this is present you can some present means this is the verb the present letters or present a speech something like that so so now let's discuss so homograph is a word that is spelled the same with differences in meaning origin 
and pronunciation so w i n d w i n d r o w r o w p r a c n t p r a c n t they are spelled the same but their meanings are different here here wind means air here here it means turn here it means line here it means noise here it means gift here it means give so the origin uh, you might not need to consider um, pay much attention on this origin because origin certain words in english they are found genuinely authentically in english but certain other words are borrowed words from other languages which we refer to them as loan words loan words uh, come to english um, from from other languages like danish dutch spanish latin greek french german so forget about this origin because that a petty issue and when it comes to pronunciation pronunciation is different here it is wind it is wine it is raw it is here it is raw and it is present here it is here wait i will i will give you the right pronunciation uh, present when when it comes to here 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 this it is present it is present here it is present and the gift uh, we present here this is present it is present and here it is present here it is present the thing here it is present present is the gift here here the action or the verb it is present so that's that's the pronunciation as per cambridge so that's basically to it when it comes to deciphering or defining homograph and i will come to our topic number two that is homonym not much of a topic isn't it homonym so under homonym 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 is a word that is spelled the same but with differences in meaning origin but with sim with similarities in pronunciation so in other words homonym is a word that is spelled and pronounced or that is spelled and sounded the same sounded the same but with differences in meaning and origin now you know how important this smop analysis or this smop petty chart is okay uh, i will give you three examples as before uh, paul and paul so here it is the stick and here it is the place as north pole, north pole south pole and bear bear this is the animal okay that furry black color creature and the polar bear is the furry white color creature and this is the bear is to meaning have for instance i can say my sister bears resemblance to my mother okay something like that and this is fair 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 means right morally right upright a fair trial trial and this is fair once again that is for that means beautiful a fair maiden uh, sleeping beauty something like that right so these are my examples here here so homonym here let's do homon homonym is a word that is is spelled and pronounced the same but with the differences in meaning and origin so so when so these spellings and the pronunciation are alike here pronunciation paul paul bear bear fair fair pronunciation okay pronunciation ticked and spelling p o l e p o l e b e a r b e a r f a i r f a i r so spelling spelling ticked and meaning and origin crossed meaning here, here because we encounter differences in meaning when it comes to both these words here paul means a stick here paul means the place north pole south pole here bear means the animal here bear means to have or incur Uh, for example, I said she, my my sister bears resemblance to my mother. 
and here fair means right morally right and here fair means beautiful so so basically that's to it when it when we're learning homonym Hom simply homonym is a word that is spelled and pronounced the same with differences in meaning and origin and i quickly come to homophone homophone so homophone is a word that is pronounced the same pronounced the same here because phone means sound phone means sound where we place emphasis to sound so sound okay we are going to take the sound that is homophone is a word that is pronounced the same but with differences in origin meaning and spelling so homophone let me show you some examples homo phones so basically there, there's a misinterpretation bit misconception among certain lecturers lecturers in the and linguists in the field that homophone and homonym are equal are they they are equal and homo homophone is another term for homonym no no my goodness that's not not the case but homonym can be seen as a variant of homo sorry homophone can be seen as a variant of homonym as an extension of home homonym but they are not equal okay they are two di two entirely different the different concepts that can be differentiated so that's what i'm doing here for the christ's sake so i'll give you two examples cell and cell here cell means something like a prison cell, a room structure. Here cell means in the transaction, transaction to transact involving money, involving money. And here, you know, here is a kind, kind of, here is a kind of large rabbit, right? It's a, it's a large rabbit. And this hair, it is what, it, what you get in, on your face and on top of your head. Uh, and when it comes to sea, sea now it's a large area of water, but comparatively in size that is lesser than an ocean. This is an area of water. And see, see now see this is the conscious action of watching or looking at something or someone. Watch or look. So basically these these are the examples. Homophone homophone. So let's go and check this. Homophone. So homophone. Homophone homophone is a word that is pronounced the same but with differences in origin, meaning and spelling. So homophone. Homophone when it comes to homophone, we are giving emphasis to phone. Phone means here homo means similar what what is similar what is same phone the sound only the sound is similar so here let's validate that point cell cell hair hair cc the sound is okay so we 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 take it but origin meaning and spelling spelling is different let's validate it here c e double l s c double l H A R E H A I R S E A S W -E. completely entirely different spellings we encounter if, when it, within the pair and when it comes to the meaning it is crossed meaning which means the meanings are not identical they are they are opposites so uh, so so entirely different two entirely different meanings here cell means a room here cell means the, the transaction involving money here involving money here hair means a kind of large rabbit here hair means what grows on top the fur that grows on top of your head and here C means an area of water a large area of water and here C means the conscious action of watching or looking at something or someone so that's basically to it this is my my own patented smob chart for distinguishing between the, the concept these three concepts of homograph homonym and homophone so homograph means you yeah 
yeah homo 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 means when it's when you take a word like homogeneous homo sapien homo means similar homo means same so what is same in homograph and homograph it is what is same the spelling graph means orthograph spelling here here spelling is same here when it comes to homonym once again is the spelling and pronunciation when it comes to homophone what is same the pronunciation or the phone phoneme the sound is same so i hope you learned something and as usual this is your friendly neighborhood linguist grammarian of the flower neo and subscribe to support adios